What is up, everybody? It's your boy Phil Shocker, the 90s Hedgehog here with um, Sorrow of the Value and gets better for you here, guys. We're here for our actually we'll go 32 stars here for our week four battle here at PSBA. This is roughly the halfway point. We need to keep picking up the wins. We're only two and one, which is not too bad, but our differential can be coming back to haunt us if we don't correct correctly. But I'm gonna go ahead and send Rick the challenge. Right now, if you guys are high, leave a like if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're new. Join the Pro Shocker crew today because you'll be feeling with the king of the crew. I am very nervous for this game as this matchup has just, it's really not, not really in my favor to win. And I've been having a lot of games be delayed this weekend. So I'm just, and I've been trying to reach out to Rick several times and he's finally now coming to talk to me and i'm just and the whole scheduling and stuff that people are doing is just not this league is kind of becoming a bit of a mess to kind of just get into the format here and i honestly i might debate leaving this league i don't know and he's gonna bring pretty much the exact six i was expecting uh no he does not he brings um no Skarmory, but it brings Gyarados. What? Wow, that is huge right there. That is huge right there. There is no Skarmory, which means this bad boy is free to click a lot of buttons. Um. Also, Magirna kind of just wins. Literally, legitimately, the commander kind of just wins now. Because Skarmory was the only realistic thing stopping me. And now he does potentially have Stealth Rock, so I do need to be careful right here. Gyarados is a little bit of a problematic for my Hula Mula. Um. Royalty is a little. Uh, I don't know. My Pegasus, though. Again, if he doesn't have a dark type right there, Pegasus is looking to sweep. Oh, 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 oh. I almost would have showed you guys my DMs and stuff. Uh, I guess. Alright, copy. Yeah. So yeah, you guys all over it for the DMs I have. So... I could see a Dragapult lead. I could see... Hmm. I think I'm pretty safe to lead off with Mamoswine. Because the worst thing he has is just... And he just leaves. Okay. Um, my Necrozma can kind of just win here now. I'm gonna leave Mammoth Swine. He leaves with the Kirim, which is exactly what I wanted. I'm gonna go for a free knock right here. Good AV Mammal. Alright, so if he specs Kirim. Which is one of the sets that I'm scared of. If he's got Focus Blast, it knocks me out. If it's Draco Meteor, it's a roll to kill me. And if he's got Flash Cannon, which he may or may not have. Why does that do so much? Yeah, I'm just going for the knock here. As he Silvalli Steel. 
Interesting. Interesting. He's so valley. So he doesn't have a dark type. Ooh, man. Man, if I had went with my gut on Scarf right there. Um, let's say Mixed Attacker. I'm going to go right into Hula Mula here. I feel like Mammoth Swine still has a bit of viability here. He's going to Flamethrower here. Let's see. We did... The Savali Steel knockoff did 24 to 29. That's about range. I see no reason not to Steam Eruption here. So he's the running the standard set. He has to be. So I don't know why he flamethrowered right there. Five to six. So you got Maxwell right there. He can't do anything unless he's got Thunderbolt. Steam Eruption still does 63 to 74. And Steam Eruption is literally a no downside play right here. So I am just going to click Steam Eruption. It's parting shots here. Goes into the Curum. Can we now have a burn? No burn. Okay. I think I'm going to go for the Toxic here. Hula Mula is really nice to have around. But I don't necessarily need to win. So I'm just going to Toxic here. The Earth Powers. Please don't miss this. Gotta be kidding! This stuff needs to seriously stop. This legitimately needs to stop. This literally needs to stop, man. 24 to 29. So we get a max roll. Is that specs? That is not choice specs. Okay, so he's not specs. He did 80%. He's probably choice scarfed. That's so stupid, dude. Superior here. It shouldn't do anything to me. I'm going to save Hula Mula for fodder. He has our power here. Don't get the Spadef drop. Thank you. And what I think I do here is I see no reason not to leave Storm. And if he's not Choice Scarfed, I'm still faster. And I can nail it with a Dragon Pulse next turn. But this is a free Leaf Storm here. He only has one resist, and that's Savali. He does go into Savali Steel. You're plus two right now. Savali Steel. So Mix Attacker set. At plus two. It's a roll to not... Wait, no, it should not come out. Okay, so Valley Steel's go down. Now, best case situation here. That's exactly what I do not want to see here. So Dragapult. Of course it does this. Let's say that's pretty out. I hate when it does this, man. Why are there so many Pokemon there like this? Flamethrower can knock me out at this range. I think I save this Pokemon. I think I sack Hula Mula here. And what he does here? He clicks Fire Blast. Okay. And I live. That's pretty funny. Um, I don't think he's going to save this thing here. I think he's going to go right back into... So I think I'm just going for a free Toxic here. Actually, let's... While we have the chance... Is that Specs Pult? And if it's Specs, is it Modest? Fire Blast. That Toxic Miss, I mean, it might not do that much, but just come on, man. Fire Blast does 13 to 15, so he's not Specs. Doing 8 to 10. So he could be Modest. 
but he's probably scarfed. Yeah, I'm just gonna toss up a free Toxic here. If he wants... If he wants to hit me, he risks a miss right here. I would rather get Guaranteed Poison Chip than going... Actually, how much is a Steam Eruption doing? I'm doing about the same 35 to 40, so I think I'm just gonna go Flash Cannon, actually. It still does about the same damage and hits the Kiron potentially coming in. I think he has to be careful since he saw I had hidden power right there. As in comes the Gardevoir! Nice! And right here, I just click Flash Cannon again. I sack off Gardevoir. Or actually... You could project the Flash Cannon again. Potentially go Gyarados, so I actually would rather go for the Steam Eruption. All right, she's going for the guaranteed knockout here. That's fine with me. I think I go Spectre here, and I just freely click Shadow Ball here. I think this is where he's going to go into Hippo. He's not going to Hippo. Okay, so Gardevoir goes down. That was relatively a big threat right now. So right here, he's going to go Hard Dragapult, because that's going to tell him he's Scarfed. He also could go Hard Kyurem, because Kyurem's probably Scarfed. Because it's not Specs. Because if it was... We saw what the damage would have done if it was Timid Specs. If it was Timid Specs, it should have killed my... What's it? My Volcanion. So, Volcanion did some really good work. That prediction would flash in. I'm actually really happy I did that now because that really chipped the Gardevoir down. Uh, Savali Steel is gone. He's lost pretty much any good realistic hit to my Magirna. The only thing that Magirna prevent what's preventing Magirna from potentially sweeping and winning this game is going to be Hippo, because literally Magirna can kind of safely beat. See, she's, she's going to go in Kiram. He he he. So Kiram, not Specs, but Choice Scarf. Does that still knock out my Spectrier? And I am sitting at plus one. I do 59 to 69. I'm going to sub here as he reveals not to be Scarfed. Sweet. He reveals not being Scarfed. So he's revealed not Scarfed. That's very good to know. I had a little extra chip, I'm not going to do it, but I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to go hard in my Tundra here. He's going to Shadow Ball. Do nothing. Can this seriously stop? So if he reveals, so what is he? Wait, does Scarf can outspeed me? Yeah, Scarf should outspeed me. I have no idea what this Kyurem set is, but I'm just gonna knock here. Get rid of Hippo's leftovers. What I'm gonna do now here is I'm gonna safely click Icicle Crash here. Do a big chunk. Pick up the flinch. I'm just gonna click Crash again. Hippo knocks out! Good! Magirna wins! Magirna wins! Magirna wins! Magirna wins! Magirna wins! Also, that flinch made up for both the Toxic Miss and the What's It. I'm going for Stone Edge here. Please don't miss. Let's go, Hippo. And now I can safely just click Knock Off. 
He can knock me out. That's completely fine. But he's going to drop the Toxic. Oh, he doesn't. But that sand should have knocked him out. Gyarados. Dragon Dance. So he's Moxie. So he's got to be this set. Plus two. Two Necrozma. Necrozma should be able to live a hit here. If he's got Crunch... Still doesn't knock me out. So I go for the Photon Geyser here. Oh, I forgot he had Z. Shit. Shit. I think I lose. I mean, I have... If he's a standard Gyarados spread... If he has Ice Fang... That's so dumb, dude. Why is this even a thing? Like, seriously. I can still live the hit. Don't you dare flinch me. Okay. Alright, so now I'm just gonna go for Dragon Pulse. And now I go Silver Bells. I am going to click Trick Room here. That weakness policy, boys! Let's go, baby! Oh, man, we pick up the W. Let's go! We pick up the W, baby! And even if he has Scarf Pole, I, got, I don't have a Scarfer on my side, so I win this game. Oh, man, that was close game, dude. GG's to Rick, man. Oh, God, that hacks was so annoying. If he had flinched me... If... Um... Oh, jeez, man, that was, that was close right there. Spectre picked up another KO, though. Spectre hasn't been doing too much. Magirna again. Dude, I have seriously been loving Magirna, dude. Superior also put in some really good work this week, too. Uh, let's see here. Um, uh, Hula Mula. We pick up the W. I'll do him with that later. But Magirna once again, dude. The Christmas magic with Magirna is still here, my boys. We can't lose a game with Magirna and McChristmas, but we now fall to 3-1. and one. We are in the driver's seat. We are doing what we do best out here. And I knew if he had crit me right there, that would have been GG because Scarf Pult would have clicked Shadow Ball and would have won this game right, won the game right there.
Oh my god, and he would have forced it to get the plus one, so even if he wasn't scarred for some reason, he was faster than me. He won that way still as well. But damn, dude, we did it! We go 3-1, and one, another 2-0 win, so we are plus four differential, which is not the greatest, but we're pushing it right now. Magirna, once again! Looking for it, but that's going to be it for me, guys. Leave a like, if you haven't already, subscribe to the official Shocker crew. Don't forget to tap that silver bell to get notified when these draft league battles go up. And until next time, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Until next time, guys. Peace.